everyone, it's Simon Holden here in Holden Horses Sports Bar for another 6 p.m. edition of Holden Horses Free YouTube with two American racing bets. And I've got not one, not two, but three. So I've got five bets for you. And our two golfers are about to tee off. But first, raise your glass to the snout. Yet another amazing selection. I can't, I, I release as many as I can free, but uh, early this morning, 8 a.m., all my mastermind clients were sent the snouts bet for today, Highway Grey. It was 130 at the time. But it's been the subject of a massive gamble and won at 11 to 8. Uh, David Allen still won, even though he completely got boxed in and had to virtually stop. So that's how. So well done, Media Man Snout. Oh, that's nice. I'm going to drink all week, so that's, anything would have been nice. But that is very nice. Chairman's Reserve Spice Rum, highly recommended. Now, you can get all the Snout bets if you join Mastermind Club, and you can also get a signed copy. You might prefer a bottle of Chairman's Reserve Spiced Rum. You can get a copy of the betting blueprint signed by me which is a good job because I wrote it. So that's it. Four services in one. Mastermind, uh, YouTube X, Media Man Snout, and Northern Big Price Coos. So I gave that one. I hope you all uh, managed to get on. It was great up at air. Now I've got two bets in America, and I've got three at Newbury tomorrow. But first, please join this channel. If you're back to Highway Grey, give me the thumbs up. I'll give you the thumbs up. I think we're going to go on a big run starting tomorrow. It's like today with Highway Grey. So we're going to go on a real run. I can just feel that I strike at 26%. So the maths tell me overall that we are due to go on a big run. Um, now, tomorrow, the reason I want so many new people to join and subscribe and click the bell is at 6 p.m. tomorrow, I can't say too much, but you really do want to be around at 6 p.m. when I release something very, very exciting. There's been about six weeks to two months in the making, and you can come and join me for free with what I'm about to show you and launch tomorrow night at 6 p.m. It will be free for you to get involved. Okay, and it's incredibly exciting and should be incredibly profitable. So 6 p.m. But we've got a lot to get through now. And the next time to look out for this line, another reason why I say join and click the bell for notifications is then you get a ping when I'm online. I'm hoping to be on by 9 a.m., if not before, with some more free selections tomorrow. Right, let's do American racing first. I won't say too much because we've got loads to get through at Newbury. We're going to Gulfstream and Golden Gate fields tonight. Gulfstream do in race card time order. The first bet is race nine. Race nine at Gulfstream. And the one to be on is Gravel Gertie. Gravel Gertie at 11 to 4. Second here last time in a stronger race. And the word from my Vegas contacts is that the money will be down. So remember just to repeat, we can take prices, take 11 to 4, because the, it's a tote system there. This is going to be heavily backed and could be much, much shorter. Uh, ridden by MSL Jamarilla for Emmett Jolly. So this is a Jolly Boys outing for us, for all Bulls and Horses fans. It's a Jolly Boys outing for us at Gulf Stream, okay? And if it doesn't win then uh, don't scream, it's Gulfstream. But Emmett Jolly is the trainer. Jolly Boy's out for us at Holden's Horses, back with American Racing, back in the sports bar every evening. Do you know that? that it really is good. Oh. Mm. Emmett Jolly, 11 to 4. Let's move on. You're thinking you can have the spice room later. 9.45 is the second American Racing tip. Race 2. Golden Gate Fields, San Francisco. You might want to chuck me in Alcatraz if this doesn't win. And the one to be on is Reverend Al. Now, Reverend, please win. I know I'm a sinner, but give me the winner, Reverend. Reverend Al at 9-4. to four. Again, there is big confidence behind this one. Like Gravel Gertie was second last time in a better race, and the money will be down. 
written by Julian Coutard for Debbie Winnick, part of the great Winnick American training family. So there we go, quickly, 9.14, Gulfstream, race nine, Gravel Gertie, 11 to four. And then 9.45, race two at Golden Gate. Will it be a bridge too far? I hope not for Reverend Al. Come on, Rev. Come on, Rev. So there we go. Two American racing bets. So get on them. But Newbury stayed an absolute cracker. Now I attend every Newbury meeting. I'm particularly sick at this lockdown lurching on and stopping us from going, particularly for a great card like that. But there you go. Now in the 155, this is our first selection. You might want to write these down. 155 at Newbury, number 11, Twilight Calls. I gave this on here last time as a confident selection for Henry Candy. We ran into an unraced monster trained by Charlie Hills. I don't even want to remember the race. It was a nightmare. We beat all the others. Now, I don't think Twilight Calls is going to run into anything like that. I said Henry Candy felt that Ascot was too, uh, too severe, too stiff. That's the word. And he was going to go back to Newbury, a flatter track, an easier track. And Twilight Call should use that pace and kick on. I can see nine to two with William Hill on number 11, Twilight Calls in the 155 at Newbury. That sounds to me like a cracking, cracking price because the horse is no mug. We just run into an absolute monster last time. We then go to the two of 30 at Newbury. There is a horse here who's been steadily Coming down the weight's been on my radar and I feel now is ready to strike. Formerly high quality, then got injured and has been nursed back, and gently brought down the handicap by one of the greatest trainers in the world. David Ellsworth, the horse is number five, Dash of Spice. And I believe now is ready to return to the winner's enclosure at a massive 12 to one. And it's Jeff Smith owned, Elsie, I believe they will get stuck into this. So get the 12 to 1 tonight on each way, number five, dash of spice. Lastly, a horse that the snout, the media man he gave last time. Now he's got, I won't be giving his bets tomorrow or Saturday on here. If you want them, you'll have to join Mastermind. He's got two match bets. One runs tomorrow at one runs tomorrow at Newbury, and one runs on Saturday. Okay, that's why it's a Saturday max play. It's clever like that. Now, if you want the snout, you've seen today, uh, highway grade, just the quality of the information, and it's available on Mastermind. All your bets will be sent by one text bright and early in the morning, and that's free. Once you've paid your 250, you're in for a full year for services in one. So 415. Our last bet, each way, number five, Watan. Now, Watan ran at York. The snout gave it at 20, 25 to one. I think it was a Sunday meeting, and it finished third. This race is not as strong, and it's nine to one. It's a classic each way bet. Okay, ran into a horse called Starman last time, which is a group believed to be a group one horse in Lambon. This is a listed race. Now, we got stuffed last time, but there's nowhere near the quality in this race. And Watan is an excellent each way bet. So you've got three good prices tomorrow. You can do it each way around, Robin. Each way singles, whatever you want. 155 Newbury, number 11, Twilight Calls. Take the nine to two, the Candyman. 230 Newbury, coming down the weight, coming down the weight. Dash of Spice, 12 to one, still a quality horse. And I believe now we'll have maybe one or two wins in it this year. Now it's down to this weight. And lastly, 4.15, third last time. Could it go two better tomorrow? Watan, W-A-T-A-N. Take the nine to one, do it each way around, Robin. These are my free selections for holding horses. Give me a thumbs up if you want me to keep coming on here twice a day, live from the sports bar on an evening where doubles and trebles are always on the menu. And the only tonic is to give the bookmakers no violence claim tonight, a gentle, a gentle slap and remove money in a nice way from their lovely, lovely wallets and uh, tills. So there you go. It's all about the winners. And I'm going to be on here giving winners twice in every day. So we've had a great day with Highway Grey. Now, 
Let's get on these. Let's have a good night in America. We've got a Jolly Boys outing, a Gulf Stream, and then we're off to Golden Gate. Please don't put me in Alcatraz. If it loses, please, because I'm going to be back here at 9 a.m. tomorrow with two more free selections for tomorrow's racing. Have a great night, guys. I'll see you in the morning. Bye for now.